This question was asked in Gate Electronics and Communication 2003. The medium one has the electrical permittivity that is equal to 1.5 epsilon naught and occupies the region left of x equal to 0 plane. Medium two has the electrical permittivity epsilon 2 as 2.5 epsilon naught and occupies the region to the right of x equal to 0 plane. If the given electric field is in medium 1, we are asked to find out what is the electric field in medium 2. So this is related to boundary conditions we have learned about electric field. Now we will quickly draw what is given and then we will try to solve it. Now this is for x less than 0, this area and this is x greater than 0. We are given the electric field at medium 1 and we are asked what is the electric field at medium 2. Now this is the x equal to 0 plane. Okay. We know the boundary conditions that is the tangential electric field is continuous. We can write it here the boundary conditions. So the tangential electric field must be continuous and here the charge on the surface is, is zero or the surface charge rho s is zero. So the normal component of the electric flux density will be continuous. Okay. This implies epsilon 1 the normal component equal to epsilon 2 normal component that is en2 will be equal to epsilon 1 into the normal component of electric field in medium 1 by the permittivity of medium 2 so by using this equation we can find out the tangential electric field in medium 2 and using this equation we can find out the normal electric field at medium 2. Now the only thing we need to know, do is we need to separate this given electric field into normal and tangential component. Now the given separation is x equal to 0 plane. So the normal to it will be x cap okay. here it will be minus a x cap and here it will be plus a x cap so the normal component of electric field is this component this is the normal component and this is the tangential component now from that this e2 can be written as the tangential component on medium 2 plus the normal component on medium 2 that is equal to since the tangential field in medium 1 and medium 2 are equal we can write it here that is minus 3 ui plus 1 uz now we are so now we need to find out what is the normal component so we have found out the tangential component here and we need to find out the normal component. Normal component is epsilon 1 by epsilon 2 into the normal component in medium 1. That will be epsilon 1 is 1.5 epsilon naught and epsilon 2 is 2.5 epsilon naught into 2 ux which is the normal component in medium 1. That will be 1.2 ux so this is the normal component so we can write the normal component as 1.2 ux so the correct option is option c now one thing to remember is that if there is some 
so first charge in the interface then this expression will get modified as d1n minus d2n will be equal to the surface charge so please make sure that you go through problems which includes some surface charge at the interface